Hi, I'm Alan McElroy from Burthen International. Burthen International are the UK and Ireland agents for the Solaris range of yachts. We recently attended the Dusseldorf Boat Show and took the opportunity to shoot some footage of the yachts that we had on display during the exhibition. So today I would like to give you a quick preview of the Solaris 64. The Solaris 64 was launched in Düsseldorf 2019. So this is its first year of production. We're now up to over 10 hulls. The 64 is the smallest of the RS range of Solaris with the Reyes Saloon. Although like her sister ships, she features very clean lines and, and clutter-free decks. Self-tacking track on the foredeck there, Solomar flush hatches and a nice system for storing away the spray hood there beneath the coach roof. The guest area of the cockpit there is slightly offset. Twin wheels set well outboard in the optimum position for the helmsman and a large central winch for the main sheet. The 64 features a hydraulically operated transom, allowing the tender to be stowed fore and aft, actually. This doesn't impact at all on the, on, the, on the stowage within the cockpit area because you still have two large lazarettes. You can just see the hatches there, both port and starboard. Custom pedestals, and these can be configured to the owner's requirements. This particular yacht featuring some nice uh, carbon wheels. And like her sister ships, all lines are led aft, both port and starboard, beneath the deck to two banks of jammers, operated by electric Harkin winches. Nice push pit seats there as well. That's the access to dinghy garage. So stepping below, the 64 features an offset companionway hatch and this delivers a number of benefits, enabling you to have a larger hospitality area to port. The interior of this yacht, by the way, I should say, is finished in teak. Saloon seating to starboard. 
this panoramic view there from the saloon windows, making for a very bright and airy saloon. Solaris work hard on the detailing to minimise the number of terminations of different materials, leading to very clean lines. The galley is full width and set in midships, well stocked with melee domestic equipment, dishwashers, drawer fridges, front opening, fridge freezers, washing machine. So particularly well stocked. and a outboard facing nav station there just to starboard of the companionway. This particular owner has gone from Mille induction hob wine cooler, dishwasher, the washer dryer neatly hidden away there as well. Front opening fridge freezer, and then two additional drawer freezers below. Stepping forward into the owner's cabin, ample stowage to starboard. the offset double to port. And the hull windows again, allowing lots of natural light. Stepping forward into the owner's ensuite. A large enclosed shower stall there with thermostatically controlled shower. Planus electric WC as one would expect. And Corian surfaces. So one of the advantages of offsetting the companionway is the ability to create the companionway going aft to the guest cabins. So I just point out that little detail there of the IWC instrumentation, which is particularly nice. So moving aft into the guest cabins. This particular yacht features a twin to both port and starboard. Both very nicely appointed cabins and both en suite. With separate shower stalls.
port. And again with the uh, separate shower stall with thermostatically controlled shower. So I hope that's given you a bit of a feel for the Solara 64. As I mentioned earlier, if you would like any further and more detailed information on any of the Solaris range, a Birth and International or the UK and Ireland agents, and we would be happy to uh, answer any queries you may have. So please feel free to get in touch.